see, let's see, let's see, let's see. What do I want to do? Do I want to bring all of them together? Hello, everybody. I thought we'd do something a little different today because, whoa, my gosh, today was hard and I need a break and it's my lunchtime. So let's play some XCOM. I've got XCOM 2 here. I've played through just the littlest bit and uh, it's great because you know what? XCOM is like teaching. It, uh, it can be difficult, it can be hard to get started, it can be lengthy to read and get uh, good at, and sometimes it just doesn't ever go your way and you have to keep on grinding and deal with the problems that arise and kind of sounds a lot like another game that I am a good fan of. So, But anyway, we're going to try to play a little bit of this today and I'm excited because I played a little bit of it um, in another save here. If you don't know what XCOM is, it's a strategy game where you get to blast aliens to smithereens and save the world. So you know what? Let's do it. Now I am on a MacBook, so this isn't super crazy high quality, but it's going to get the job done and it's going to get me through my lunch break. XCOM 2, I got it for $3 on Steam, which is a, uh, if you don't know what Steam is, it's a store where you can purchase games and they run lots of great sales. So if you're interested, go check them out. I think this is great for teachers. Uh, if they have like a small 15 minute window and you want to play something a little more substantial than whatever's on your phone, go grab a Steam game. Don't put it on your work computer. This, that would not be a good thing to do. Put it on your personal computer if you have one that you bring to school. And, uh, yep. So let's get started here. I want to do a new game here. And I'll keep it on veteran difficulty. Um, I'm familiar with XCOM as a whole. And, uh, yeah, that's good. I don't need the tutorial. Let's just move on through here. Enable Iron Man saving automatically. Yes! Every choice you make is final, just like teaching. There's no saving the game and starting it from the beginning. I do have a save scrub file. That's what I'm using to learn how to play the game, but we're just gonna do this. We're gonna enable Iron Man. All right, so I'm skipping through some of the uh, screens here, some of the movies, so that if you are actually interested in playing the game yourself, you don't get any spoilers, um, no super huge plot elements. All right, here we go. We're going to land into the city. Let's see where we get dropped off. We got our four squadron soldiers here. Our mission is to get to that point and blow up the monument. Awesome. The aliens have uh, really been taken over this little city here, and we got to get all the way over to here. Now, there's going to be a bunch of aliens that are hidden in the darkness here, and we got to get over there safely. It looks like we don't have a time limit, which is nice, so we're just going to take our time. We're going to spread our people out. All of these guys are rookies, so no special abilities. Everybody's got a grenade that we can throw out, so we're just going to spread these guys out here. Let's see, I want this guy. Let's send you way over here. I just want them in safe places for now, because I don't want to lose anybody, and I don't really want to activate any of these aliens that might be walking around. Now, once they're in their spots, looks like no aliens have been triggered. We're going to go to Overwatch. They're going to look around, see if anything moves, and if they do see something that moves, they will fire at them. All right, here we go. First turn. Over. All right, I'm safe. So we're going to inch our way out. We're going to inch Oh wait, out. I like this cover here. Do we see anything? We don't see anything yet. Looks like I'm in in good shape just to keep on sneaking through. Let's see here. I'm really just gonna inch my way up here. That's good. And uh, let's get let's get him watching. Let's get him watching, and then we'll do one more big move here. We're up to the front. Here we go. Anything? Anything happening? Anything happening? All right, all right. So let's see. There's something up here. So, and there's some. So, one of the things in this XCOM game is you can see um, these red dots here. If you go in that space, then you will be detected. And there is a big tower here 
that is kind of like a watchtower. So we're going to avoid that for now. We'll inch. Let's see here. I think I want to bring. Yeah, we'll stay over here for now. Let's bring this guy over a little bit. Tiffany. Tiffany Burton. Tiffany's going to handle the watch here. And then we're going to move forward, see if we trigger anything. Nope. We're just going to keep playing safe. Keep on inching forward. Keep on inching forward. That looks good. All right, we'll go. Let's see. Uh, let's see here. I don't want to go out way out here. If I go all the way out here into the yellow, then I lose my chance to watch for things. So I don't really want to go out too far there. But it looks like this zone in here might be safe. I don't want to leave him alone. Let's just go to the edge of the car. All right, let's see. Let's creep up. I think we can creep up to the edge, maybe. I don't think. Let's see here, because we're still in concealed. Let's move up. We're still concealed. We see where we're supposed to go. Okay, I think we can bring the group together a little. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. What do I want to do? Do I want to bring all of them together? Do I want to keep them set? I think I want to keep them separated. Let's bring... Let's bring you to the car. Put you on Overwatch. Put you on Overwatch. I think I'm going to bring these guys forward a bit. Let's go on this side. Yep, there they are. Our first squadron of aliens that are on patrol. Let's see here. He's the only one who could fire on them. I don't want him to fire yet, so we're going to hunker down. We're not going to do anything. We're just going to wait. All right, now that I know where the first grouping is, let's bring these guys forward here, and we can run an ambush on them. Hmm? Let's see. If I bring him up to here, that should provide some decent cover. Good. So what you want to do is you get all of your people into position so that they can make um, a firing on the group of people once they start moving. But I have to get them into a good placement. He, This one's in a bit of an awkward spot. I just want to bring him forward enough. Uh, let's try it back here because then I can move him forward on the next turn. All right, we'll put you on Overwatch. Who's going to make the first shot? Who's going to make the first shot? We can bring him actually pretty close, too. But let's put him into some decent cover. I think that's what I want to do. All right. Let's see. 67% hit rate. Hmm. 67, 66. They're all about the same. 66. So they'll they'll do about the same. What I think I will do is put the edges on Overwatch because they're kind of no. Nah, let's put the center on Overwatch because there's a little aim penalty. Okay, first shot. Here we go. Let's see how we do. And oh, we take him out. Nice. Now they're gonna start moving.
Nice. Everybody's down. All right. So we've taken out one group. We've lost our element of surprise on the whole board here, but now we can kind of move forward a little more aggressively. Let's put you on Overwatch to cover for anybody that moves. Let's put you over here. You'll do the same. There's another group. Yeah, they see me. Oh, that was a miss. That's okay. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I want to get rid of... None of these are really going to be great shots here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put you on Overwatch. Because the guy in the red, they like to run forward. And I don't like it when they run forward. Because they've got these stunning batons. And they will... Knock out one of your guys pretty quick. That looks like a decent shot. Let's go for him. Here we go. All right. That was lucky. And then we've got our one here who still needs to move. I'm not going to go all the way up. That just does not make sense right now. But he's the last person to go. I do have a frag grenade that I can take out that one but I don't think I can get close enough. Let's see. Where do I want to place you? Because there's not really any good cover options here. I like where I'm at. You're already holding there. I think I'm just going to go to Overwatch. See what happens. Here we go. Mm, not good. Oh, Overwatch removed. I've never seen that before. Miss. Okay, you're up. You're still up. You're okay. You're okay. All right, now I gotta be aggressive here. I'm going to move forward. Up. That gets you into a good spot. Let's move you forward. I got to be aggressive here. I got to be aggressive. So, but I still need good cover. Mm, let's go there. I think I'm going to take this one out with a frag grenade. Yeah, because that's only 58%. So let's go ahead and take him down. Let's deal with that now. Okay, that leaves that guy. I've got two, two to move here. Do I dash or do I cover? Nice and easy. We're going to move you forward there. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Can I reach with a frag? I, I can. So I could do two frag grenades to definitely take that one out. And then I can rush my last person up to the green spot. Let's do it. Nice. He's down. And my last person can just run. Actually, you know what? I'm going to pick this thing up. Nice. Scanners are clear. Awesome. I can just go right to this spot, plant the charges. Plant. Now what? 
Is that it? Is that done? Did I do it? Nice. Kablooey. Ah, oh, that's satisfying. That feels good. Got an excellent rating. Eight turns, pretty quick. All the things taken out. Nice job, guys. All right, I think I'm going to wrap it up there. That was a great start to things. When we come back, we'll take a look at what your home base looks like, and we'll make some adjustments to uh, how to get that going. But this is fun. I think I'm going to do this during my lunch breaks. This is nice. All right, tune in next time. Thanks for watching. Give a like below. And if you're interested in supporting any of my classroom stuff, I've got Donors Choose at the bottom. Go check out the links. I've got a really cool NFT project in the works. So if you're interested in checking some of that stuff out, um, I'm going to get that up running soon. And I hope you enjoyed this. Let me know what you think. Yeah, go, uh, go play some XCOM.